Hey, back here talking about all kinds of cool stuff. Coconut water, maple water, even birch and cactus waters. Quick inventory of beverages in the produce section really makes it clear that these plant-based waters are very popular. Popularity is rising. Mm -hmm. And our nutrition coach, registered dietitian Suzanne Farrell, here to explain now. We've got just a nice little variety of everything. Yes. One that I've drinking, drank drink, drink, drunk <laughs> quite a bit is the coconut water. Mm -hmm. But let's start with one. I yeah. haven't heard of the, the cactus yeah, water. So what's interesting is some newer ones are popping up on the shelves. Mm -hmm. And so yeah, cactus water, very interesting. It's made with, it's got water in it and prickly pear extract, prickly pear cactus puree. Mm. Um, and it's got electrolytes this. and antioxidants known as beta lanes, which have been linked to being anti-inflammatory. Oh. But what's interesting about it is years ago, mm -hmm. there was a study that showed that having some prickly pear extract prior to consuming alcohol decreased symptoms of a hangover. Uh -huh. So that was pretty interesting okay, so fact prior, about the cactus water. Mm -hmm. Prior to, and yeah. that one actually tastes very refreshing, very light. Yes. It's got a great flavor. Yes, and I should note with all of the waters, for the most part, many of them, always look at those added sugars. They mm -hmm. are a lower calorie, lower sugar alternative to some other beverages on the shelf. Okay, But like still look at that. And, yes, okay, still okay. look at that and pay attention to your intake. Let's um, move to maple water. So maple water is so great. It's literally tapped from the maple tree, hmm. and as opposed to the syrup, it's the opposite of sugary. It's very low in sugar. Okay, yeah, because um, you would think maple, you're thinking very, very sweet. You would, and absolutely not. It's the water before making the syrup, so again, oh. very low sugar content, mm -hmm, and mm -hmm. it's got um, phytochemicals, electrolytes, and trace minerals of note, manganese, which is a trace mineral that it's rich in, okay. and that's linked to bone health and absorption of nutrients. Oh, so, I love it. another okay. option. And really random one, burnt. Birch yes. water from a birch tree. From I'm the assuming. birch tree. Okay. So similar to the maple that it's tapped right from the tree. Okay. Um, and just again the Try electrolytes. It's got xylitol in it, which has been linked to decreasing cavities um, and tooth decay. Okay. Um, and then birch tree also has saponins, which are compounds that have been linked to lowering cholesterol. Again, none of the health claims have been uh, studied for the waters, but sure, these are but some things just that could an be idea. in the water. Yeah, exactly. Okay, we have about 10 seconds left. Yes. This is my favorite for post-imbibing coconut water. Yes, lots of, <laughs> lots of options, and its real claim to fame is that it's a very rich source oh, of yeah. potassium, over 600 milligrams, more than really a banana, so it can be a source of that, which can help, you know, potassium is great for fluid balance and mm -hmm, blood pressure mm -hmm. regulation, but just there are so many varieties Definitely double check that labor for the added sugars for all the sugar. that can be in some of them. Okay, yeah. Suzanne, thank you so much for joining thank us. You. And of course, check all these waters. And as she mentioned, check the sugar content on that. I know, I know, Tom, you love that sugar. <laughs> <laughs> I, I've had it every now and then. All right, thanks very much, ladies. It's almost eight o'clock on daybreak. A tough day.